This one is an amazing situation here that I, we're going to talk about here um, as we transition to another topic. Fake his own death? Retail tycoon Carl Aravin Haub was declared dead after he vanished under mysterious circumstances in 2018 on a ski trip to Switzerland, but now it seems he may be living in Moscow with his mistress. Haub was last seen alone on the ski lift, but he never returned to his hotel, and his body was never found. He left behind a wife, two children, and a company of 75,000 employees. Now an investigation has revealed he's living in Moscow with Veronika Ermolova, who is 20 years his junior. Haub called her 13 times in the three days before his disappearance. <laughs> Yo. Yo. <laughs> that is wild. So it's also, they're also uh, saying that he could have been in a little bit of financial mm -hmm. trouble, like in some deal business dealings mm -hmm. that played uh, also a part in his disappearance. And so he was recently spotted, like you said, they said in the video in Moscow, but I'm like, damn, how you, <laughs> the wife is one thing. Okay. Like I I'm gonna keep it a book. The wife is one thing you don't want to have to split, but like technically that would mean that she would be entitled, you know, you and your kids based on whatever your last will and testament, you know, would be. So like, did you just start over, or did you like stash money somewhere where you was good? Oh, was he good. had to have stashed money. When them, yeah, like he my offshore account, yeah. Because I'm like, but I'm like, okay, again, the sounds fucked up. The wife is one thing, nigga. You got kids, and you just was like, fuck them kids. I'm, I see, it's, see, this is this is what I mean. You see why I don't be wanting to be dickmatized? I said this on my podcast so many times. Dick and Coochie will make you act a damn fool. You think you now you're not about to control me with your magic stick. Now, would I control you with my cootie cat? Not likely, but still. Stop. That coochie ain't that like I told you when when how they've been acting a, that that this to Quavo. I said, do we need to sleep with Coochie? Because the coochie on Karuchi gotta be <laughs> immaculate. This makes That's no true. sense. Like, I, like I, and I know that sounds crazy. Like, damn, like you and I understand motherfuckers want to leave their partner, but I'm like, not to the point where they are faking dead. Fake their death. That's wild business. And I think they said he disappeared and he was finally legally declared dead I, I forget the date that they said but that means that if he even if he resurfaced like he could not be punished by law because mm. like even here i think it's seven years they'll declare you but that's in, that's in the u.s but that's he in, over in europe yeah but that's what i'm saying like what was the time frame when they legally declared him dead because now he wouldn't reap the uh In 2021, 2021, um, he was declared dead by a German court after an extensive search yielded no results. Mm. And then, but then they said, so after this, uh, they said investigations by journalists from RTL, whatever that is, have prompted the state uh, prosecutor's office in Cologne to look at into allocations of Hall's brother, Christian. He may have provided false information regarding his brother's di disappearance. So he been in contact with people and evidence, including photos allegedly mm. showing Hall in Moscow in 2021 has surfaced. According to reports, there is a significant resemblance between him, the individual and the images in Hall with similarly around a similarity of around 90%. So they're saying it might be his brother? No, they're saying it might be him based on, they said the brother likely gave a false false report. So the brother he was probably is likely in on it is what they're saying. And then this person that they're okay. seeing in a, around Moscow is about not, I don't, I don't, okay. Like I'm not trying to be funny. 
there's certain places if I want to fake my death where I'm not going and, and, and staying in Germany is not one of them. I'm not interested in it. Like, no, no, I you gotta understand. Knocked out. You got to understand. He, you, we can't. He can't be deported out of. You can't go in and get him in Russia because of all this stuff going on right now. So that's why he did it. Why he's in Moscow? Yeah, but this happened in 2018. Right, but I'm saying, but I think he, he are. I mean, like, yeah, we've already had. We've had issues with them for the last five years. Well, I know. Germany has too. Though, I know, but all I'm these saying, I'm saying so. so because it's still, if they launch an investigation, I don't know what their laws are. Right. Yeah, right, right. I, yeah, Versus I don't know. ours, because if after seven years you can't, it, 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 you you can't be prosecuted for anything, because like that's if a it's over that's seven like, years? yeah. If it's over seven years, if I'm not mistaken, yeah. But why is it over seven years that you're not prosecuted? Why is it, why is that the? So if I like, take my death and I stay years, out like of the they really, if they if they declare you legally dead after seven years, uh. Cause that's that's a that's a crime punishable by law. By law. So, right, but why, that, why is it like think... it open? Why after seven years can I I can just pop back up and then it's all good? I don't know. I didn't write the laws. Like, yeah, we'll have to do. We'll, we'll look. Let's see. Um, uh, I'm googling it now. Let me see. Yeah. How. All right, so I'm just looking here. It says, faking a death is not a victimless act. The people who grieve they believe was a real death are usually angry, and sometimes they're, those who are unaware that the death is fake may be feel emotionally abused and manipulated. But they said, it's, you know, legally you can do it, though. Wow. Yeah, yeah. So it said, in proceeding under this part, a person who has not been seen or heard for, from for a continuous period of five years by those who have likely seen or heard from the person who's absent, uh, blah, 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 is legally declared dead. So it's like after five years. Dang. Yeah. Dang. It's, it's, it's like I'm seeing mixed stuff. Yeah. I'll have to uh consult with my attorneys on that one. May, yeah, yeah, yeah. We want to it may it may vary <laughs> state to state. Um but um yeah, maybe after maybe he got some information and he felt comfortable kind of moving around because you was off grid for four years. Yeah, I mean maybe he thought it was all good or I don't know what he was. And know. also, I'm like, nigga, like, like, you didn't think to get your face altered? And especially if you got money. Especially if you got money. Uh, like, yo. you, didn't think you didn't watch Face Off? Hey, y'all, if you like what you see here on Everyone Needs an Aquarius, be sure to hit that button right there. It'll take you to more clips and be sure to like, subscribe and share our podcast. See you back next time.